Rochelle welcome back to my life it is vlogtober day four and we are outside now to be honest I am so tired but I promised you guys a vlog every single day and you are getting a vlog every single day so tonight it's Friday we are outside we are actually going to hit a chill spot get some bears then we are heading to a second spot we are going over to Moonshine because they are having a influencer link up with a very popular Caribbean influencer. I can't wait for you guys to see who it is. So, chill spot, then Moonshine. It's going to be a fun night. Let me go. So, we just got here and there's music so I can't really talk for too long. Jason is um, inside making the order. I just want some high room. That's the National Bear of St. Vincent and the Grenadines. It is our Independence Month, so it's high room for me. What I wanted, and it's so cold. I wanted to wait on Jason so we can share it. <laughs> I was waiting on you so we can quick. <laughs> oh wow, so cold! So cold. Love that. I'm trying to understand why the place is empty though. Is it are we like too early again? <laughs> Hopefully it's a different vibe when we get to moonshine. Anyway, we are leaving chill spot. But see, I um, I just like fell into that hole. Do you see that? <laughs> anyway, um, the vibe is just there's no vibe. There's no no nothing. So we just had one bear each, and now we are going over to Moonshine, which should hopefully be a lot more lively because that's where the actual influencer meetup is happening. It's not something that I was going to go to. I literally just saw the flyer this evening and it was just perfect for a Friday night out. So I'll see you guys when we get at Moonshine. Okay guys, and we are at Moonshine. I don't know if you can see the parking lot, but it's full, the music is going, and as I thought, this really is where the vibe is in comparison to Chill Spot. So I'm not saying that Chill Spot isn't a great hangout spot, but it's more quiet, tame, low-key. If you're looking for a little bit more excitement, then Moonshine is the place to be. Well, at least tonight. So we're going to head upstairs and see, you know, what's happening, see who are the influencers turn up tonight. I'm tired, but still a little bit excited so let's go upstairs yeah Like a domino, 
check it once, you check it twice One more time, yeah, it's alright, no, no I just gotta let you know I'm hanging on like vertigo Got my head spinning around Cause I can't stop thinking about you I don't wanna slow it down Yeah, my mind so guys, um, <laughs> we got here and I did not see this on the flyer, but they are charging $25 per person to go up to Moonshine and I don't feel like I want to pay $50 for Jason and I because I really only planned on staying like 15 minutes max. So I feel like um, I'm gonna scratch this off and I'm not going home I'm going to find somewhere else to go that's what I feel like I can buy food with $50 versus going up there spending 15 minutes just for the content you know what I mean um, I'm so sorry I really wanted to meet this influencer this Caribbean influencer but I don't feel like paying $50 for Jason and I so I'm so sorry we're gonna go somewhere else okay we're, we're going somewhere else guys i'm so sorry i do not know what happened to the audio here and you see we were wearing our mics but before i left i was able to speak with this lovely young lady her name is oh my goodness was it crystal yes i believe that her name um is crystal and she was able to give me some really good information about what was happening now the event at moonshine last night was basically a precursor or a promo event for a cannabis festival that's happening in st vincent and the grenadines on november 1st to the 3rd so it's a three-day festival they're doing it in partnership with the medicinal cannabis um companies here in st vincent and the grenadines because um you know cannabis was decriminalized i believe for medicinal purposes so there have been a couple of companies set up in st vincent um, and who are taking advantage of that so those companies as as well as some local um, companies have come together to sponsor this event and as i said before it's a three-day event and they're going to be having some educational um aspects of it some um some like teaching you or you can get to see firsthand how you know the products are made and it's going to all culminate with a massive reggae concert they have some international artists coming in they've already um revealed two of them i believe one is jameel and another person that i can't remember right now and they have two still to reveal as well as a host of local reggae artists so like i said it's happening november 1st to the 3rd and it should be great if this is your type of thing then definitely go ahead and check it out i know the whole medicinal cannabis industry is you know a little taboo for some people but if it's your type of thing then definitely check it out i may go to the reggae concert we'll see so if you guys want me to go to the reggae concert comment down below and let me know but again thank you crystal so much we had such a great conversation i'm so sorry that i lost the audio i really need to do better at checking these things so guys on to the next clip okay guys so we are now on the fountain stretch and we are going to prestige um I remember I had some bomb loaded fries from here a couple years ago. Hopefully they have not changed their chef and it's just as good. So we're going to head up to Prestige, order the fries, maybe have two more bears. Yeah, and then um, take the fries to go because I really wanna go home. <laughs> so yeah, let's go to Prestige.
So guys, we um, are at Prestige now. We walked in. There are a couple of um, people here. Um, it's pretty dark. I don't want to turn my light on because it's going to be so obvious and then it might make some people uncomfortable, which I never aim to do. We just asked for a menu. So they're bringing that. I'm hungry. I just want the food to go. Okay guys, and we are going home. I showed you the loaded fries. They look loaded. They look pretty good. So I cannot wait to dig in. As I said before, we are at Prestige Bar. I learned that they are under new management. So I hope that there are really good things um, in store for this space. I love that it's outdoor. So I wasn't hot at all, but there's also a covered section in the event that it rains. So um, we're headed home tonight. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Um, I always try to say Vlogmas. Vlogtober Day 4. If this is your first um, video that you're watching, definitely go ahead and check all of the previous ones. Hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.